Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very long, and it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started, and we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter attacks if you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot. It can have a, a devastating effect, actually, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. And that gets things running. Tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Drives it towards the front. Played towards the front men. Dashing forward at pace. Plays it out to the wing. He's got options out wide. Gets up to head it! And that has been cleared. Forward it goes. Well positioned to make that interception. It's being played forward. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. Did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Oh, good interception. Up towards the front line. Gets wrestled off the ball. Tries to get it forward quickly. Neither side yet able to find the net. Sprayed out wide. Chance to cross here. Over to the left. Now a chance to break. He's got through. He's l and the shot! It's in! First club draw. And a trademark move ends with the inevitable classy finish. Look, if you want to be effective on the break, then the key element is always pace. That's what really rips the fences apart. And it's difficult to find an answer to it when it's applied like that. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. That's the whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football. That it still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now.
brought back on the first 45 minutes. Peter, this is far from a lost cause. Yes, they've been hit once by a, a pacey opposition, but they've asserted more control and, and look capable. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. So we're just settling back into this second half. A solitary goal. That has been the crucial difference. Plenty waiting in the middle. And he's cut it out. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Floats one over. It's out for a goal kick. Oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Forward it goes. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Now the counter. Well, well played, he saw that coming. They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Atletico go are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Played in with accuracy. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Plays it out to the flank. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Drilled in low. And the referee brings it to a close. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, a result which... Over